What we're trying to come up with here is a system to keep people who don't need to go to hospital out of hospital. So we found that there's 60% of uh, emergency calls that don't require hospitalization. And from those 60%, 40% still do go to hospital. So that's because there's no, um, no one has stood back to think what the current ambulance should be to, in order to deliver uh, care in the community. So we've been working on a system of mobile emergency healthcare, and that includes a series of vehicles uh, from uh, small fast responder cars, motorcycles, uh, but also ambulances. And uh, we set out to design the ambulance first. Uh, easy to see what's inside and clinicians can uh, just use what they need on the patient rather than stretching across the patient to get, get, get what they need. Um, these treatment packs are designed to be um, movable so they can take them with them uh, but also easy to restock. So if they, they run out of uh, cannulas for example they can just change pack per pack instead of having a team coming inside the ambulance to restock all the, all the equipment. Another thing about that we've worked on is a digital, digital diagnostics and communication system that allows us to monitor the patient and send real-time information using simple technology that you will find, find in your smartphone or tablet. At the moment, what we have here is a model and it's a demonstrator. It's been evaluated by crews all throughout. Uh, it took us three stages of iteration to get to this model. But what we want to do next is uh, create a fleet of uh, working prototypes so that we can uh, test them in real world situations.